My dear friends, gathered here today, let us embark on a journey of introspection and contemplation. As we delve into the depths of human nature, let us remember that, nature never deceives us, it is we who deceive ourselves. This profound truth calls upon us to question our own actions and motives, for often we are blind to our own faults. In this quest for self-discovery, we must embrace our uniqueness and individuality. Each one of us is different, and as I once said, I may be no better, but at least I am different. Embracing our differences can lead to a society where diversity is celebrated, rather than stifled by conformity. As we ponder our place in the world, let us recognize the importance of education. It is through education that we find the strength to overcome our weaknesses. We are born weak, we need strength, helpless, we need aid, foolish, we need reason. Education is the key to unlocking our potential, and it is a gift that we must cherish and share with others. In our pursuit of knowledge, we must be cautious of the dangers of vanity and pride. The English think they are free. They are free only during the election of members of parliament. True freedom comes not from external appearances, but from inner wisdom and self-awareness. Let us not be blinded by the illusions of power and fame, but seek the genuine freedom that comes from knowing ourselves. As we navigate through the complexities of society, let us remember the importance of virtue and integrity. Heroes are not known by the loftiness of their carriage, the greatest braggarts are generally the merest cowards. True greatness lies in the sincerity of our actions, not in empty boasts or grand gestures. In our interactions with others, let kindness guide our way. What wisdom can you find that is greater than kindness? A simple act of kindness can have a profound impact on someone's life. Let us be compassionate and understanding, for in the end, it is the love we show to others that truly matters. In our pursuit of knowledge and wisdom, let us also embrace the beauty of imagination and creativity. The world of reality has its limits, the world of imagination is boundless. Our imagination knows no boundaries, and it is through creativity that we can envision a better world, free from the chains that bind us. Let us not be afraid to challenge the status quo and question the established norms. Force does not constitute right. Obedience is due only to legitimate powers. It is our duty to question authority and seek justice for all. Let us be bold and courageous in our pursuit of truth and freedom. As we conclude this journey of reflection, let us remember that life is a constant learning process. Our affections as well as our bodies are in perpetual flux. Change is inevitable, and it is through our experiences and challenges that we grow and evolve. My dear friends, I leave you with this thought, it is a mania shared by philosophers of all ages to deny what exists and to explain what does not exist. Let us not get lost in abstract theories and ideologies, but remain grounded in reality and the truth that lies within us. Thank you for joining me on this journey of self-discovery and reflection. May we continue to seek wisdom and understanding, and may our actions be guided by kindness and compassion. Let us be the change we wish to see in the world, and may our legacy be one of love, knowledge, and freedom.